All right, we are going to kick things off with a golf cart, a Rolls Royce King of golf carts. All right, and it does have a name right here. The owner saying goodbye to Eisenhower. All right, and with this golf cart, you will be the envy of all your neighbors. Well, here he is, saying goodbye. Yeah, there's the owner. His flip-flops and cigarette. Pimp in the golf course. You're the man. All right, so here we have some Ninja Turtle crochets. There's Raphael, Donatello, Leonardo. Uh, but we got a missing turtle. Yep, Michelangelo is missing. And guess what? This person is from the city of Orange. Yep. You would think somebody from there would, you know, remember Michelangelo. You know, because of the colors, but eh. no, we're missing. Don is not too happy about it. Okay, here we have one of those iPad fridges selling for 1100 bucks. Alright, so the owner is selling it after just three months of ownership because this fridge has a small scratch on the front of the door. Barely noticeable unless you really look, but it bothers me. So I'm selling it. Alright, he bought it for 2200 and in three months he's selling it for 1100 because this scratch I don't know if that's the same scratch. It's bothering him, damn it. So he doesn't want it anymore. Okay, here we have um, Oreo Cookie Masters of it. Yeah. Motu? Okay, it's Orco from He Man, but I don't know what's going on here. Okay, so here we have some used ladies' undies. Is this still a thing? I thought this thing was all done. This phase of used undies. But I guess not. Ah, $30. I don't know if $30 for all of this? Or a single one? I don't know. Size 3X. The large. Social distance meetups. Okay. IG. Sammy Juices. Enough said. Alright, here we have a free wine bottle opener and the owner wants you to just drink your worries away you know what I might actually need this and it's serious persons only even though it's free and he's really looking forward to hearing from you okay okay so here we have a double mug and this really confused me is this for decoration or is this for drinking? Because if it is for drinking, then how on earth do you use this thing? Is it for two people? Like, I, I, I just don't get it. It doesn't make any sense to me. Okay, so next we have these free used hinges. Yeah, they kind of look nasty. Alright, well, there's 18 pair of them. These are very old and painted over. Maybe you need some spares. Maybe you like a cleaning and refurbishing challenge? Free on the porch, swing by. I mean, how much are new hinges? Is it really worth picking up free hinges and cleaning these? I don't know what this guy's thinking. All right, up next is a no dumping road sign. Now, I'm almost sure it's illegal to sell something that belongs to the city, but hey, this guy's doing it. Or what I'm thinking is probably what happened was this guy took it down and then realized it said no dumping. So obviously he couldn't dump it or else he would get a $750 fine. So well, he just took it with him so he doesn't dump it, right? All right, next up is some VHS tapes starring Trace Lord. Actually, Tracy Lords. 
have VHS, maybe last one, have two title. Okay. Um, looks like these are some rated X, so it's not triple X. And it looks like he has a few of each. All right, uh, let's see what else we can learn here. Trace Lord have two titles on VH8 tape. Got a new format? Maybe 821 This Legal Age? What? I have a VHS tape, two title only. Brand new, several I have asking $20. Sold before each 25. So I guess he's giving us a discount. Thank you. Picture from my copy. Maybe you can get a copy. Okay. On DVD from the internet. What does he mean by that? He has VHS, but not the DVD. Is that what he's trying to say? Business, no copy original. From the company, now close their doors. All right, looks like the company is referring to maybe pink video here. Pink video, close their doors. But he still owns them copies. A few of them, so maybe they're worth 20 bucks each. All right. All right, so it looks like we got another adult-related item. This one is Bianca. For sex doll, $1,050. I don't know if those are the prices for these things. I don't know. And there she is, and all her glory. And look at it. And wait, this looks like she has her own bed in the closet. Okay, I guess she can stand up pose and have different wigs and different clothes interesting now oh, sunglasses on her bed okay posing oh okay all right interesting now what else let's see oh wait it kind of looks different here okay is that it's more like a guy here okay Okay, back. Wait. That's a girl face. That's a guy face. Which one is it? Okay, and we are missing her head here. And that's the coffin, I guess. Let's see what it says here. Up for sale, full size Bianca Six doll. She comes with a storage case and wheels. She is 5'3, weighs 85 pounds. She's very heavy. Yep, 85 pounds is pretty heavy. Wow. Also comes with extra head. Oh, that's what it is. So, so you got the girl head, and I guess you got a guy head? Okay. Interesting. Huh? I guess maybe it is worth a thousand fifty. Let me think about that. Alright, up next we got a hundred dollars worth of quarters. Yes. 90% silver coins. All right, and he is selling it for a whopping almost 2,500 bucks for 400 quarters. I don't get it. Is this supposed to be special? Silver, what? I mean, they're not even clean. They're just dirty quarters that you can get anywhere. Is it? I don't get it. If anybody knows, Anything about quarters? Let me know. All right, so we got a bowling ball here for 20 bucks. Not bad, uh, but the seller wants us to know that it's more nearly spherical than the planet we're on. All right. All right, so for this one, somebody wants to trade for a vintage Harley Davidson and what he has is something unusual. He has the deed of a plot of land in a cemetery. And he wants a vintage Harley or $10,000. Now, what are the chances of somebody who has a Harley and is like looking for a plot of land in a cemetery? Very slim, I think. Okay, so next we got these wall mounted mannequins I mean, look at it with three legs they just look so weird and look at this isn't that weird looking with no body parts on the wall 
looks like something out of a horror film. So for the next ad, somebody wants a flux capacitor and he's willing to pay $100,000 for it. Now that's a lot of money. Okay, let's see. I really need a flux capacitor to put in a DeLorean, which I also need. Wait, you don't have a DeLorean? Money as no object because I can invest in the past and easily make it up. Wait a minute. How could you invest in the past when you don't even have the parts? You don't have the car, you don't have the flux. It doesn't make any sense. Let me know if you have one available. This guy's a scam artist. We have a doll, a 12 inch male adult doll for $50. And here he is, posing on what looks like a bathtub uh, with some candles, of course. And uh, let's see what else we got here. Uh, oh, yep, that's the bathtub. He is packing. Okay, I mean, the doll's 12 inch, and that thing looks about two inches. Jeez. Full genitalia and is fully posable. Pick up only. Okay, and there he is. Uh, looking good. And uh, just waiting for his next master. Alright, so up next we got Ras. Uh, it looks like Ras is a retired barber. So he'll come over and cut your hair. He does out calls to your salon, nursing home, hotel, wherever. He'll be there. Uh, by appointments and he gives discounts to seniors so awesome guy uh, but one thing I don't get is why did he Photoshop himself in the gym I don't get that connection I mean you know he's a barber a hair salon would have made more sense but I don't know what he's trying to say here all right so here we got some weights Dumbbells, uh, firm price on that for a million dollar. Okay, uh, well, let's take a look and see if it's worth it. All right, so we got, uh, I see here several weights here. Uh, okay, some more, a uh, few more used, of course, nothing new. Oh, rusted, of course. Mm -hmm. And the seller wants not a penny less. I mean, is this really worth a million dollar? I don't know. Uh, let's see. What you see is what you get. Nothing more, nothing less. One dollar per pound? What? What does that mean? Does it mean he has a million pounds of weights? Note, kettle, ball, plastic coated and filled, all used. Um... Um... A million dollars okay so here we have an ancient ceramic lamp for $85 so I'm guessing it's about a thousand year old right it says ancient uh, let's take a closer look here okay yep uh -huh. these are the measurements great this is an ancient ceramic lamp the craft is very delicate it is worth collecting very nice okay uh, it is powered by electricity just to let you guys know if you guys are interested okay awesome all right looks like the previous seller has one more treat for us uh, it does look like another lamp it says ancient understand okay. ceramic table lamp for hundred and twenty dollars ceramic let me see here looks more like plastic but you know what ceramic plastic whatever and here oh yeah looks like some palm trees on it and the usual measurements yeah he loves his measuring tape uh, okay let's take a look here ancient understand what does that mean ceramic table lamp made in china the workmanship is very good High collection value. It's made in China. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, some used clothing here for five dollars. Okay, 
Let's see what we got. Lacte in athletic. Okay, take a dive into my smells with my. Oh no. Oh no. Lemonade. Oh no. You know what? I think we'll just end it right there.